buddies, welcome to Sea of Thieves. This is Dan Ron with Trash Ass Gamers bringing you an achievement guide for three achievements Hunter of the Cursed Captains, Mercenary of the Ancient Order, and Master Hunter of Villainous Skulls, which we like to call Villainous Skulls on the Seas. That's going to be awarded for the commendation of 700 skeleton captains defeated, awarded for the commendation for 150,000 gold earned from Order of Souls voyages, and awarded the commendation for 360 Villainous Skulls sold. So, um, the good thing about this is we're really going to combine all these into one guide, and I think the best place to do all of these is to do voyages in the Ashen Lands. And the Ashen Lands you are going to see are in the bottom right side of the map, and these are going to be the areas that have the erupting volcanic lands, and Morrow's Peak Outpost is going to be where we're going to pick up these specific voyages for this specific area. And again, you're going to know you're in the Ashen Lands because you have these volcanic eruptions from these islands as opposed to the quiet nice islands on the rest of the map that have the pretty blue seas here we're out in the ashen lands right we've got volcanic ash the sea is dirty the volcanoes are erupting so just be sure that you're picking up the quest from moro's peak outpost and then we're going to propose those have them vote on those quests and that's going to give us skeleton captain quests to go defeat in the ashen lands so why do i like to do them in the ashen lands and that's for two reasons one you can see these geysers that are erupting all over the islands when you're on them and they actually help you while the skeletons in the ashen lands give you better items one i think you have a higher chance to get villainous skulls it seems and the are they are worth more because a villainous ashen skull is worth like 2400 gold um, so you're going to get a lot of gold from getting those, but also these geysers are going to help you kill those skeletons. You get gold skeletons, you just kind of round them up near the geysers, and the geysers explode, and they kill those captains just as fast as you could on a normal island with the weaker skeletons. In fact, I think it's even faster. So going to the Ashen Lands is going to give you the help of having those geysers to kill the skeletons, and you're going to be getting more gold from the skeletons that you kill. So there's really no reason to not do Order of the Souls quests in the Ashen and land so I highly recommend that that's where you go to do it um, so other than that it's really just a little bit of a grind right so but just keep doing voyages you're also going to get credit towards the 250 voyages as well but um, we spent one night in the Ashen Lands just questing, and we made about 125,000 in gold. So you can really get the 150,000 pretty easily. So this was all the skulls we ended up with that night. So I hope this guide helped you out, um, give you a little bit of tidbits and advice for getting those three achievements. If you found it helpful, feel free to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time on the seas.